Hi guys, hello, welcome to my channel or welcome back. I'm Lola. So today I'm gonna work around the garden and I'm gonna take you all along with me. I have projects with pallet woods. I had them since two or three years ago but never do anything with it. So I guess today is the day. So stay with me and let's do something today guys. So guys, I have three wood palettes and I'm gonna paint them all white with Kiehl's Primer. These three wood palettes, uh, they're all not perfect but I'm not trying to make them look perfect. I just give it two coats of primer and after that I just go with it. I like the look, uh, it's rustic and I keep it. So when all it's done, painted white, I put a stencil on each uh, wood palette. Uh, I'm using acrylic paint. Uh, the color is black from Deco Art. I bought in uh, Dollarama with a stock card I bought from Michaels.
So this is how it looks like for the first palette. I'm stenciling my second palette now with the word birdie. And for the last palette, I will write Garden Tools. Once it's all done, I seal all the stencils in rust -Oleum Spray Clear. So I want to use these birds I bought from Dollarama for one of the palettes and I'm gonna spray paint them black with rust -Oleum. So I have an old teacups, uh, I will use it for one of the palettes as a bird feeder. So I'm going to glue the cup to the saucer using my E6000 and my glue gun. And after that, I'm going to put the jute twine around the cup so I can hang it to the palette. Hi guys, so I'm done painting the three palette woods. I give them stencil already and I put the hook all over them so it's easy to hang stuff. One I'm gonna use uh, for storing my gardening tools because you know I don't have a shed and if you don't have a shed like me, it's a it's a good idea to put everything in the same place because I'm so clumsy and I put stuff all over the house and then I forget about them. And then the second pallet wood, you remember when we stick the cup to the saucer? It's sticking already, it's very safe. I leave them for three hours. So I have three. And I put jute twin around the cup and it's ready to hang as a bird feeder and the other palette wood i'm going to use it to put some plants some flowers so i'm going to put jute twin around it and hang it on the hook
so yeah basically I'm gonna do uh, like this to all the pots I have over here and ready to hang it so it's all done ready to hang and I'm just gonna use hooks I get from Amazon so this all like several hooks in different sizes like this they have the big one too and they even have really small let's do it so guys I attached one already so this palette will be uh, all pots for the flowers For this palette, I attach a birdhouse I bought from Dollarama using screw and dowels and birds also from Dollarama that I spray painted black earlier. Using my E6000 glue, I attach all the birds to the dowels. Oh yeah guys, the yellow tea kettle I got from thrift shop. I think I pay 5 cents for it and I think the yellow color is really pop. For this palette, I use a lot of hooks all over it to hang all my garden tools. So for this palette, this birdie palette, I add extra greenery and twigs I found from the backyard and Spanish moss inside the tea kettle. I think it's a cute uh, birdie airbnb or squirrel. I put it in the backyard near the forest. For the last palette, I'm using an annual flowers. I put it on my backyard near the barbecue area. The pop of colors make everything look more beautiful. Okay guys, that's it for the project today. I hope you enjoy it. And I think I just got myself a new selfie spot. 
over here <laughs> thank you for visiting my channel and watching and then don't forget to share your comment like and subscribe because it will help my channel to grow bigger see you again in my next project Ta da